Margaritaville? Yes, please. Well, good morning, everybody. Today we are going down to Longboat Key, but I'm leaving Oscar here, and me and Jim are going. Let's go. All right, so we made it to the marina here, Safe Harbor Pier 77. That's what it says up there, anyway. We are going into the marina here. I think Jim's trying to get the boat out. Yeah, the boat's over here. All right, so yeah, they're gonna put our boat here on a rack outside so we can work on it. This is a 34 LS Tierra. It actually just has a recall from the manufacturer for this through hole fitting down here. It's actually a high speed scoop right here. It's got the cut in it so it'll catch water. Well, they find out they don't want that to happen anymore so it doesn't push too much water pressure into the generator. So we're gonna change this out. All right, so down in the hole, here's our other side of that scoop. It's actually a through hole valve. That's all made into one piece here so I gotta get the ground wire off it on this side here. Get the uh, actual valve off, hose off, this nut off, and then we'll be able to get the other side of it. So Jim's on the other side holding it. Let's see if we can get it to turn. Alright, so we got the whole piece off here. I'm going to take the handle off. This just screws into this fitting here. The new one, which goes underneath, doesn't have those cuts in it, so it won't pick up water at high speeds and over-pressurize the generator. The fun part is, though, that's pretty heavy sealer, so it's going to take a little effort to clean that up and get that crap out of there. She's free! Alright, so he's got glue on his side. Put some on our side. All right, so we got it all tightened in place and everything. Let's uh, get all the rest of the parts back on it. All right, she's all back together. We actually have this muffler here. Also had to take out of the way, but we're all good. Valve's working, outside's clean. She's all sealed up. Give her another day or two, she'll be 100% cured. That being said, I'm gonna get out of the hole here because it's hot as crap in Florida. Head to the next job down the road. Well, welcome back. We actually made it to Longboat Key Moorings. Right down the road, about 20 minute drive from where we were just at. We have spotlight controller we gotta put on. So we'll get there, I'll show you. It's gonna be a pain, uh, you know what I'm saying. All right, change of plans. We actually came to look at this boat so we could do the controller on the light. And the guy must be out in it. Lucky it was just down the road. So we're gonna head back to the shop now. It's about an hour, hour and a half away from here maybe, so. I'll see you there. All right, so we're back at the shop. Actually, I'm already loaded up for tomorrow for Tampa because I'm staying here for the rest of the day. The 355 behind me, I got to work on. It's uh, actually sold. I got to do the first service because we used it for a demo boat a couple times or went to a boat show, so it has 15 hours on it. So we got to change the oil, do the gear oil in it, run it, check it, make sure everything's all right, but that's all boring. I'll actually show you the inside of this boat because the interior of these boats are really cool. Let me show you the cabin. All right, let me go downstairs here. It's loud out there. Get we're drilling. Alright, check it out. This is all the new style Pursuit does. I like that fabric they got there. There's a mirror. All the same kind of. This table right here actually lifts up and down so you have a bed. You put the, put the piece in here for a bed. Here's all your AC panel stuff for your shore power or generator. TV above it. It's got lights everywhere. Oh, here's that table. It's electric, of course. All the LED ambient lighting, of course, stove top, microwave, big fridge, freezer. And that's just one place to sleep. If you go under the stairs here, you got like the second bedroom, Your second sleeping quarter here. It's even got its own AC and everything back here. It's cool too that you can put rods down here and store them. 
And here, of course, the my favorite for some reason, the bowl sink. Oh, look at this nice. Everything matches. So, all the new stuff. I see it's brand new too. It's all the stuff you get with the boat hoses and all sorts of stuff. Most fully working toilet shower system. Just fold this thing open and look. When you open the shower door, it's storage behind it. The clever little things they do. Of course, it's always going to be the same awesome stereo. Yeah, this has the same Pursuit Dash they all have, which is really nice. The twin Garmin's, the Yamaha display. It's got all the new Yamaha stuff. This is a twin 425 boat now. This would usually have three motors, but because of these big, giant motors they have now, you only need two. Well, I'm gonna do my services and finish up the rest of the stuff on this boat here. I'll see you guys tomorrow for Tampa.